All right, I'm Andy Slade with Team MDT. I'm here today to talk to you a little bit about tuning your mags. Our metal magazines actually come tuned from the factory, so you shouldn't have any trouble at all with them when you get them. But should you drop them or maybe catch that feed lip on something and it either close the lips or open the feed lips, you could run into some issues. So um, that's with any metal magazine, and we can show you a couple different possible feeding issues that you could have and how to fix them. So first we're just going to show that this rifle is feeding okay without any uh, adjustments. So we've got a slow feed, a normal feed, and then a fast feed. All right. So the first and most common thing that could happen is you drop your metal magazine full so it's heavy and it lands on concrete or something hard and the feed lip closes, especially maybe on one side. Usually what will happen at that point is your bullet, your barrel, I mean your bolt, excuse me, is just going to slip over top. So like it's either going to run hard into the feed ramp or it's just going to completely stop or maybe the bolt skips completely over like that. Okay, now the next thing that can happen is let's say the magazine gets hung on something and it opens up the feed lips too much we'll have an issue where that first bullet's gonna dive like that and not have a good feed all right you can also have if they're open way too much you end up getting your rounds just pop out like that so if that happens what's going to happen is you're going to just close the feed lips back up now when you go to adjust this i think the best way to do it is to pull your cheek piece off Pull your bolt out, and you're gonna look at it from behind, all right? So what you're looking for is about a third of the cartridge. So think of the center of the primer as being halfway through the, the cartridge. So about the top of the primer is about a third of the way down. And try to make sure they're even on both sides. So when you look at the back of the magazine, try to make sure the feed lips are even, meaning one's not bent in more than the other. All right, so now I've got it back to about a third. That's what we're looking for, and the round is nice and level. If your feed lips are too wide in the front and your tip's up, when your bolt comes back for feeding, it's going to make that tip present high, just like that. And what will happen is then the bolt will skip over it, and it'll try to drag from the middle of the cartridge and cause a jam like that. So what you want is when you're adjusting this magazine, you want to make sure that you adjust it to where the feed lips are pretty equal down the sides and you get a good level cartridge when you run your finger back. So I still got a little bit low in the back and you might have to tune it just a little bit based on your rifle, but see how that's nice and level when I run my finger back across it like that. A third of the cartridge in the back, that's, that's good contact. And then when we press across the cartridge, it comes up nice and level. That's exactly what we're looking for.